Design for Disassembly, or DFD, is an innovative approach in architecture and construction that has gained significant traction in recent years, particularly in the context of modular and mass timber buildings. This design philosophy aims to create structures that can easily be taken apart, allowing for the reuse, repurposing or recycling of building elements and the overall better adaptability of buildings. Design for this assembly aligns with circular economy principles, focusing on minimizing waste and maximizing resource efficiency. In construction, this approach involves designing buildings with their eventual disassembly in mind. Key strategies include using modular components and reversible connections to simplify the deconstruction. Material selection also plays a crucial role, prioritizing materials that can be easily separated and recycled. Additionally, maintaining detailed documentation of the building's materials and assembly methods ensures their efficient recovery and reuse at the end of the element's lifespans. Mass timber construction, which incorporates engineered wood products like cross-laminated timber and glue-laminated timber, is particularly well suited for design for disassembly. One key advantage is its modularity, as mass timber components are often prefabricated off-site making assembly and eventual disassembly more efficient. This modular approach aligns seamlessly with DFD principles. Instead of relying on adhesives, designers can use mechanical fasteners like screws or bolts that allow for easier separation of the elements. The material properties of wood also contribute to its suitability for DFD. It can be easily cut and reshaped has a long lifespan when properly maintained and is biodegradable at the end of its use. Moreover, mass timber buildings designed with this assembly in mind offer greater adaptability, allowing for modifications over time to meet changing needs, extending the structure's functional lifespan. Integrating design for this assembly into mass timber construction provides several key benefits. It enhances resource efficiency by allowing for the reuse of high quality timber components, reducing the need for new raw materials. This approach also minimizes construction and demolition waste, as elements can be recovered rather than discarded. Additionally, DFD helps extend wood's carbon storage capacity by allowing materials to be repurposed in new structures, contributing to sustainability efforts. There are also economic advantages, as reusable components can lead to cost savings through resale or repurposing. Furthermore, mass timber buildings designed for disassembly offer greater flexibility, making renovations, upgrades and repurposing of spaces easier over time. Although design for this assembly offers significant advantages in mass timber construction, there are also some challenges and considerations. One consideration is the potential increase in initial costs, as design for this assembly may require additional planning and specialized materials. Building codes can also pose a hurdle, as existing regulations may not fully accommodate DFD principles requiring adaptations or approvals. Additionally, successful implementation depends on industry-wide adaptation, with construction professionals needing to develop new skills and processes to effectively integrate DFD into their practices. As sustainability becomes increasingly crucial in the built environment, Design for disassembly in mass timber construction provides a promising path forward by combining the renewable nature of wood with the principles of the circular economy. DFD in mass timber construction offers a blueprint for creating buildings 
that are not only environmentally friendly, but also adaptable and resource efficient throughout their life cycle. The growing interest in this approach is likely to drive innovation in connection technologies, prefabrication methods and building information modeling to support DFD principles. As the industry continues to evolve, we can expect to see more mass timber buildings designed with their entire life cycle in mind, from initial construction to eventual disassembly and material reuse. If you want to learn more about the world of mass timber, subscribe to this channel. Stay informed, stay inspired, Timber Talk.